putting my earrings on it's so dark because like it's evening i had to literally come back and rush now and change off i'm going to my friend Bertil's event she has a clothing line and she's just um launched something new do i pull this in front i think that this is fine i'm wearing this jacket with this crop top this skirt is really nice and it's from zara okay with a black purse and shoes okay i want to talk to you guys but i think i'm gonna do that i'll find very good lighting and do that once i'm back okay well hi guys welcome to a new vlog i'll see you guys probably at the event but like i'll talk to you guys like later today you say you don't want to get in trouble that you don't find because you got me i don't want to break your little bubble but you gotta wake up to reality because i can see wipe the front of this camera let me take the, oh my gosh so i think i'm gonna wipe the lens just a little bit guys close your eyes after i cleaned the lens i saw that the battery was almost dying so i had to swap that out oh this is saying i have one minute on my memory what's all this say this is like the fourth time i'm going to get up from here i need to get a new memory card really quickly please bear with me guys finally i found a memory card that works so the event that I went for or to is my friend Bertil's event and she has a new, oh, she's, it's not new actually, she's had this brand out for a while and it's called Mirella Brogi Daughters, I hope I pronounced that well. She has these very very nice gorgeous pieces, so well made, like they're just beautiful, like she was wearing it today and there were a few of them that were on display, not a few of them, quite a lot of them were on display. So you can get them from the store where she did the events that she did today and I think it's called RJ4. I'm going to leave the name of the brand, the Instagram handle in the description box, I'm also going to leave the address for where you can get her stuff or her clothes in the description box okay so it was a very good event i had just seen her less than two weeks ago so it was nice seeing her again there's an ac right in front of me here we're in the rainy season so it doesn't get as hot as it typically would you guys might hear the rain whatever but i had to switch up the ac so that it wasn't interfering too much with the sound, okay? I had a few things delivered. Some of them were PR packages. I have about two PR packages from Pixie that came while I was away. And I also, some of the things like from AliExpress, see somebody needs to stop me where AliExpress is concerned. Ever since their shipping became fast, tracking became reliable, everything just became better. It's like every two seconds to the point that I feel like stuff that I could actually get go to the market and get sometimes if you do the math is way cheaper on AliExpress you're like let me just pay and wait like two weeks for it to come so I've been doing that a lot so the first package I have here is from AliExpress okay so let's just open that the thing however for you guys to note so the reason why some of these even came late is that 
when you order, not every single item you order from AliExpress, let's say in a bulk order, would come. So this particular thing I'm opening right now came in the batch of the like two vlogs ago I did an unboxing, right? This was part of that particular order. But then this particular vendors did not ship via PDF. I don't even know how it works, but this came via the post office. You guys can see how it's looking wrinkled and suffering. Okay, that's what the post office does. But anyways, they called me said I had something, so I went to go and pick it up. It's essentially a hard drive case because guys, I do a lot of editing and I don't really want to get into the technical part of it and how editing works, but I try as much as possible not to edit via my computer's drive. A lot of editors will tell you this. It's very, very important that your final cut or whatever, Adobe Premiere, like your files, are actually stored within a hard drive so that when the processing starts like it takes a lot of work off of your computer's drive and your computer lasts you a long time when i initially started editing like my first two computers just they just perished okay very quickly and it was because of all the work they would do and before you know it i'll get to that point where my my the fan in my laptops they're making this very loud sound whenever i'm exporting anything and it's because they're under a lot of pressure but this is a hard drive case basically it's from a brand called you green i really like this because you can fit so many things into this okay there's this little section here for memory cards sd cards um i love the fact that there's this like padding or cushion inside um because hard drives can be a bit fragile there's a space here for the hard drives i'm just now wondering what kind of slim hard drive actually goes in here because i'm seeing that this is a bit thinnish but it will fit my hard drive right and there's a section here that you could put your wires and cables in and this section with the band is where you always put your hard drive so i'm really happy that this finally came when i spoke to you guys around the time that i got my ipad i told you guys of how i ordered a case for my ipad from amazon right i paid a certain amount for it when it was delivered here guys they did not even why do i feel like this is not even the size well i'm hoping that it is i remember complaining in that video that my ipad case they, like amazon did not even bother to put a bubble wrap right and as a result when the case came it was scratched already i don't know why i feel like this might not actually fit my ipad i think that this is a wrong size looking at it i'm going to get my ipad to try but can you guys see i got this from aliexpress and it actually came in a pop proper bubble wrap the case is protected it looks really great let me get my ipad and actually see if this fits I am back guys i have the suspicion that i bought something smaller than i was supposed to buy i also don't know why this is kind of it's looking like the size of my partner's ipad and because of the color now i don't know if it's going to take it from me but like guys if this does not fit i'll just give it away on instagram or something like that it looks good it's the perfect green that i want why on earth Ugh, gosh let us try i just know it's not going to fit what I don't even understand oh i'm actually now understanding hold on it actually fits but the thing is that this is not a hard case i'm just understanding this now this is not a hard case okay it fits it actually fits but this is not a hard case so it's kind of magnetic so what it does is that it just kind of gums to the body of the ipad itself and it's actually very strong because you can see the ipad is not falling off but then it's not a it's not a hard case so this one has a rubber like layer that the ipad actually sits in right but then like i said it was delivered to me scratched this is flat it gives it a very very sleek feel if you're trying to protect your ipad man you need something that has a, a hard case there will be scenarios where this will come in convenient but i don't know there's this section here so the pen is actually supposed to go in but it's nice i can work with it i just have to be very careful okay the next item that i have here i had hoped that this would come before i traveled but it didn't and it was a makeup um bag i legit have a version of this already but then i have had it since 2018 or so 18 or 19 and it's all banged up all scratched up i got it from amazon it's just very old okay i saw that they were selling it on aliexpress for not so expensive and i was like i'm gonna get it it's a makeup case like this okay i like this type of cases because they're hard cases like nothing ever breaks or spills in these right basically you're able to arrange your makeup space for your brushes 
it's just really nice so i got this as well the last thing i got is a makeup kit um no not makeup kit a jewelry kit you know guys know i love green i love teal so this is the oh my god i actually do not like the quality of this Ugh. i thought that this would come at least with a zipper but this is a jewelry case let me see if it actually has layers that open up okay so this is a jewelry case that you can just put your jewelry in while you travel and then what i do not like is that i had hoped that this would come with a zipper it doesn't come with a zipper it just comes with a pin but sometimes when you're traveling you want to just arrange everything inside one place it doesn't matter what type of jewelry it is you just want to know that your jewelry is inside a place where it's also like kind of protected this is nice it's actually cute i'm gonna have it linked so i have a package from pixie here right this is the first one from pixie it's small it's a blush oh it's a blusher so can you guys see so this is the on the glow bronze so they are bronzing sticks 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 oh this color is so gorgeous it reminds me or just going by what it looks like in the packaging this looks very similar to max blush and raisin it's like a peach coral thing yeah Oof. this is beautiful guys i think that this will really work great for it's like a stick bronzer or it is a stick bronzer and it's very sheer and light so it is buildable i like it it just gives you a very nice glow if you guys have noticed with my makeup routine i don't use like shimmers on my cheeks i haven't done that in a very long time there's a pink and there's a um, what's this color called so what are the colors called the first one is rich glow it's a tinted moisture st this is also chaotic but i really wanted to talk to you guys after i came back from this event this is cute the next one is kind of on the pink side and this will look greater or better on people with lighter complexions this one is called warm glow okay actually also twists it's very cute i'll give this to my sister who is lighter than me okay you guys can barely see anything it's just like a tinted moisturizer thing that i think you actually just maybe use when you're going for a very natural glue, very perfect for the summer, I think, or I believe. Oh my gosh. Then I have one more package from Pixie and that will be it. I just wanted to get this unboxing out of the way. I was supposed to do this before I started getting ready today, but the katakata it was mush. Okay, before I actually left the house. A lot of things were running late, a lot of people were running late. It's just long. Okay, so it took me longer to complete some tasks. This is the other PR package I have from them, which is a much bigger box. This is the Pixie Clarity Collection. Thinking that this is skincare. Okay, there is a, a lot of like. I'm actually really, really interested in this. This is the Clarity Collection by Pixie. So, this is targeted at people with combination to oily skin. I'm really excited because this is a whole skincare routine in here. And I want to try these products out. So the first thing here is a clarity cleanser and it has salicylic acid and probiotics in it. I've added some active ingredients. It looks like this. So this is a cleanser. And there's a small size toner, which is a salicylic acid toner, clarifying toner. It looks like this. Okay, this is probably sample size. There's a, a serum, which is the clarity concentrate. It helps refine the pores, promotes even more even skin tone and a smoother complexion so smooth two to three drops into the into clean skin focusing on problem areas i'm really excited about this collection okay there's a clarity lotion which is a moisturizer it has let me see oil free formula hydration while minimizing the appearance of pores Da, 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 da. I'm trying to see if it says, but I think that this also has. Okay, so it says this oil free formula provides an instant boost of hydration while minimizing the appearance of pores, leaving a healthy looking shine free finish. Okay, what I don't know is if this has salicylic acid in it, but then again, I, I get that if this is to be used together, everything in the range should not have salicylic acid in it so i'm really excited about this range and i will be trying these products out okay and then the last thing in here is the zero zit spot solution so this is like a targeted thing that you apply on active breakouts okay 
so that's it i wanted to chat with you guys i wanted to show you items that i had here tomorrow is going to be very busy for me it's like a sunday normally i go for like a later type of service like i don't go for first service or even sometimes second service i tend to go for third service but tomorrow the way it's looking out i might end up going for some, one of the earlier services they have and i have my first vlog since i came back going up tomorrow so my birthday vlog is going up tomorrow i'm really excited for you guys to see it how's it guys i'm gonna see you all tomorrow let me take off this wig and wash my face i have one more thing i think i need to show you guys no i'll show you guys tomorrow in better lighting okay okay hello boys and girls it's like every other vlog i'm showing you guys nails but <laughs> dior is here as usual <laughs> she's so cute and we're doing like short nails guys if you see the speed when dior came here, i was like cut cut it cut it like those long nails were for me to go and do guy in their abroad okay i'm serious now and i need to make money this month so she's about to kind of repaint my nails we're kind of playing around with colors but she will give me like i think i want to do that green that i didn't do in the previous vlog okay and yeah I'll, I'll see you guys after i'm done with this but yeah it's a new day like after the day you guys saw me yesterday and i'm repainting my nails okay 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 we're done um you guys kind of noticed in previous clips that i had like red polish on sorry like, this is so distracting <laughs> sorry i switched that out to this color because yeah i talked about this color in the previous vlog i really liked it so and i think it really complements my skin tone so this is the color that i'll be working for maybe about two weeks and then i'll change it again hello let me close this door hello buddy your hair in my mouth that was just way too chaotic i keep saying hi to you guys in this room as if i don't have other rooms in this house don't worry i'm going to change up i want to run an some errands really quickly and i want to leave the house i just showed you guys my nails in better lighting they look so good my mom is around by the way i haven't mentioned this but she just came she came recently and guys have been eating good she's been in the kitchen cooking for me because she's like every time my mother sees me to be honest not to lie like her automatic thing is to feed me so i've been eating good i'm not even going to front okay so i have some clothes here I put it in my denim bag and these are just clothes that I need to amend. So I got a skirt and a pair of like trousers and what else do I have here? And then this really cute dress that I got from ASOS that are kind of all big. So I wear a size 10 but most of the time I have to tailor the waist of my jeans, okay? Most of the time. I got this pair of dad jeans from ASOS that I really like. I want these to be my everyday kind of trousers I got from Zara. It's a size 10. The waist looks fine because it's made of really, really stretchy fabric. But I found that when the denim is like kind of an in-between, not too stretchy, not too strong and thick, I have to do some tailoring. So the trouser and the skirt and everything is a size 10, but I have to my lip balm in i have to tailor it in so i'm taking them to my i'm so distracted so i'm taking them to the place where i'll do my amendment i also want to stop at my tailor's place because i have a dress that has been there since december god i feel so ashamed i know that nobody can see my ears but i'm going to wear earrings i'm going to call my tailor now just before i leave and ask her if she's available let me come by so i'm just going to carry my to a birch tote i really really like this tote bag i linked it in my previous blog i'm going to link it i actually bought this base of recommendations from the youtube work girlies like when they're talking about work totes but i i like it like it works for everyday things for me it also works for like travel and stuff so let me rush off and do this thing that i have to do and then my mom made gym miracle for me her own gym miracle i've really not eaten she's kind of like what when are you going to eat when are you going to eat and i'm like when i come back i'm just going to Hold this jacket or this shirt with me just in case or should i even tie it around my waist i don't even know what today's fashion is giving but i'll wear that shirt and i'll carry this bag let me go i'll see you guys when i start these errands okay guys okay this mirror is not that clean but i just want to show you guys like context so these jeans are looking very straight right now and when i start walking so there's a lot of excess fabric on this side i don't even want them to touch the waist per se but i kind of want them to hold it at the hip right you see right now the folding is reduced whereas like it's like this so they're going to have to just maybe take about an inch off and it's also like gaping like the waist to be honest i don't mind but the hip i really want them to do something about okay just for context um guys i am running late for my second tailor's appointment
appointment i'm not gonna i'm not gonna make that i had to cancel so i'm seeing her tomorrow we've agreed on a time but i want to stop at ebano to get items that i've kind of run out of i don't know i can't i can't stop touching this hair this is why i look he like it when hairs off of my face and by the way that curly wig from a couple of vlogs ago that christy sent to me oh my god it's so fire it's ready now i'll show you guys but let me go to Ebano in and out okay guys good morning i am exporting okay a video can you guys hear how loud this computer is i've had this since 2018 and i'm not even going to front and say that it has not tried for me but uh, it's making a lot of noise these days when it just comes to exporting and i know that i'm due to actually upgrade it but i am exporting a video that is going up tomorrow sorry i'm sitting on that chair that really quicks my mom is still around i'm going to go down now to eat breakfast so because she made you miracle again for me my favorite oh Guys, I've been having a good time, like I've been eating good, but she said to me today that she's never eaten amala before and she wants to try it out. So I want to take her somewhere. So I'm thinking that maybe we can do dinner at knock so that we can just have like a whole like, because we've actually not gone out, okay? Maybe when she comes back the next time, I'll give her the buka experience, especially if she likes it but we've not gone out yet so i'm thinking of maybe both of us going out to dinner going to knock i think that's what we're going to do hopefully that is possible but i want to eat okay so let me go downstairs and eat oh. my forehead is finally clearing up i think i got rid of the last two breakouts yesterday guys like this whole thing just started with me kind of changing environment a little bit and probably other factors but it was a lot hmm. Let's go down. Okay, my mom is making ofanko. Basically, this is like the Igbo banga soup, but we don't eat our own with swallow, we eat it with rice. And she didn't get the canned um, banga oil. She's kind of making it the way she likes to make it. I'm so excited because, guys, my fridge and my freezer, I'm going to show you guys the amount of food I have. But this woman is hell bent on feeding me, and I'm not even complaining. So she's processing the aku now, and she's going to start cooking shortly. But the Jimmy Rock is ready. Let me stand up and eat that. This is my yam and my soup with this big fish here. My mom is not asking me why I'm drinking cold water. The doctor said she should stop drinking cold water. Which doctor said that cold water is not good, mommy? Doctor said he want me to block or he need me. Can mommy? Can you come below? You get shot blocking him, madam. Does that even make sense? Can be Chinese in what tea joke or flush? Mommy, can you get Richard Giano? I be young, what tea school. You are mommy, that's not even true because of Buddha says she was logging a boon and I'm not tea joke. Moon, Richard Henry. I bought my man a phone. I got a doctor. <laughs> doctor. Okay, check I bought no man a phone. Mommy, my house is city car for Madidi. Like Ima Foggy, Ima house is city cord. Yeah, my how warm you my hoggy the kid can you buy it again but okay so they can bond no man a phone I don't believe that because you are new school mommy give me what so you can eat minute minute no man gets what it's called because this is so chaotic mmm no man has a phone so no man has a phone mommy you know what they delay me ring ring I'm not thinking she put on the tukura and the baby baby ring ring so no man gonna miro you now no man choice so you don't buy it Cherry, cherry, can buy a regular call. Not been a FaceTime. I'm keep on that ring. She can buy. Hello, no man. Not been a FaceTime. We're going to meet in Djibouti. Be very near. But mommy, sim can you hear me? I'm going to miro you. I talk as nasa ngos na miro you. Man, eriri. Can you talk to me? She's nasa ngos na miro you. Man, eriri. And see, okay, can you hear Doctor Joyce? She's nasa ngos na miro you. She's not doctor. She's nasa ngos na miro you. Not got congee. Nee, 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 nee. Now for you. Mommy, no deny. Mommy, mommy, can you talk to me? Mommy, 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 mommy. Mommy, no not stand on the doctor. Old school doctor. I say, mommy, no matter how I see the car for mad. In my body, where I carry my hair for mad. I see the no for mad guy. Watch a hunger car. In where I die. Okay. Old school technology. Okay. Technology, no need my forget. No my please. Mommy said I should call you to put this argument to an end. That's not the meaning of miro. You cannot draw meaning of miro in doctor. No ma. No ma. It's not the cold water. Is what? It's not fine. She said it's just fine. She didn't say not. She said just. Hey, no one, no one, no trouble. You try to put it on Nasias. Mommy, I want to blackmail because this is not for me. But no man, I don't want no man. Keep this. I'm not saying no man. I don't want no man. No man, no man, no man. 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 No
Mm -hmm. No, my so it's what my point that I'm vlogging this thing. So as a medical doctor with a license, it's called what are good or bad. No, my mom, you are not serious. Please buy both of you. Let me eat. Gosh, this looks so good. So so good. I don't even know the. My mom always cooks things in large quantities. I don't even know the last time I ever used a pot this size. But this is what she likes to cook with. So almost done. She's going to add the vegetables soon. Oh, oh water! Yeah, of course, my water. Is it going to affect the taste? No, because it's too thick. It's a vegetable. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a good one. It's a good one. Don't go. It's good. I don't want it. It's going to be so many vegetables. I like it. I only like it going in soup. So it's done now, have you? Yes, it's done. The soup is done. Mm. So she puts that leaf inside. It's not even soup, it's stew. The stew is done. Ufa. There's smoked fish inside, have you? Ufa, 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 I know it's a There's smoked fish inside. Yes. Uh -huh. ufa, ufa, banga for... It's not even banga. This but it's the one ufa, they eat with swallow is slightly mm. different. It's ufa, ufa. Thank you very much. This is good. I'm getting that for seven months. Mm -hmm. Guys, okay, it's a bit dark. Can I increase the ISO? The ISO is on automatic, so I think it's fine. I am about to put on my wig. I think I want to wear that curly wig that I got from Chrissy before I traveled. By the way, I'm wearing another dye lab boo boo. Let me show you guys. Okay, it's just as gorgeous and as majestic as the previous one. I actually didn't get this one myself. My partner got this one for me after he saw me raving about the previous one. He was like, you really like their boo-boos? And I'm like, yeah. So he got me this one, but every time I look at this boo-boo now, I want to cry. And the reason is because I made the stupid mistake of taking my two dial-up boo-boos that were not cheap. Every time I think about it, like, I remember, like, I had a whole meltdown last week where I called the Norma and I called Fedro on a conference call and I was raking. What had happened, the normal dry cleaners that I take my clothes to, it kind of takes them a while to actually just wash and return. So there were these other people closer to my house. And I was like, okay, let me try them. Tell me why all my dye lab boo-boos come with iron marks. I don't know if this is showing up on camera, but the cotton fabric or the ashoki that they use on the neckline, all of them, I just see all of them have marks or are damaged by iron now and what are you going to tell these people they've already collected your money and they've done nonsense a lot of people who say that they actually dry clean on the island they don't dry clean I'm actually being dead ass right now like thinking about it's just annoying me so what I just want to do is I want to replace one of them and when I get money I will buy a, maybe I'll replace this one too the thing about dye lab and also the reason why this is pissing me off is because they have collections so there were like previous designs from like last year I, I remember around the time i bought from dial up that i wanted to buy they were no longer available so you have to buy when they're still able to produce a particular pattern it's just mad but anyways i don't care i have been told that it's not that bad or it's not that obvious i personally can see it and it's driving me nuts anyways what i'm going to do now is okay let me put on a bracelet first okay and then I'm going to bring that wig and try to put it on here. It's supposed to be like an easy type of wig to wear for me. I hope this thing is recording. So I'm wearing this bracelet here. I think it's Fendi. I got this like two years ago or something. It's nice. I'm going to wear my wig before I wear an earring. So let me grab that wig. So this is the wig here that I'll be wearing. This is that wig from Chrissy. Bro, why is it looking dark? I'm sure it's not going to be dark by the time I look at it, but this is what it looks like. I'm going to pop this on my head now. You know what, guys? Let me go to the mirror behind me and put this on. Okay. I'm back. I actually quite like it. Hold on. I like the way it's sitting on my head. I have some baby hairs here that I think I might want to put down or not. I don't know. Yeah, but this wig is... Is it peasy? I think I need to play around with it a little bit, but let me wear earrings. These are my regular, regular, regular 
I wear these like and you know like I feel like I've worn these earrings so much that some of you have asked me if I have some sort of like sentimental attachment or if it was gifted to me guys this earring is from new look or H&M butter and I've had it for like seven years or something like that it's just like my earrings they tend to loss this one has refused to loss and as long as it has refused to loss and is access I go to wear them okay I don't know if you guys can see the baby hair things I'm talking about I think I'm gonna go to the office sit down do something really quickly to this hair come back okay so I'm going to be wearing my white orange slippers the brown ones they tend to get way more action than this white does for obvious reasons I'll be carrying this bag from I think a French brand called Pauline I got it on this trip they're quite popular on Instagram and I think that this is really cute but I want to show you guys a perfume that I'm going to be wearing out because I'm not doing any makeup I'm technically ready to leave the house this is from a brand called Bodacia I think this particular one is I think is from their Victoria's range and I think that this they said it was for the Queen's Jubilee that they created this particular perfume so I told you guys that I got two perfumes in my Q&A video this one and Dior Rivera so this is just like a quick unboxing because I haven't opened it yet you guys see it looks so good and I remember it smelling so good I love floral perfumes already told you guys this one they said was made with like seven different roses so when I smelled this I was like this smells like heaven it smells so good it smells just as I remember you don't do because perfume is not cheap okay. to create a little bit of confusion I'm just going to put um, Dior's dream dusk okay can you guys see over there because this is also very nice floral as well I'm gonna take some items from my regular shregular bag I'll take some Dettol hand wipes okay um, toilet seat cover to you guys about this one before hand sanitizer okay um my wallet okay and just an atomizer a small like kle thing that i have here okay i don't want to be fighting with this hair i like it i love that it has movement especially when i am moving i also I didn't want to use any glue, got to be any type of glue on it before leaving. I love that my skin is also giving skin. I have some dark spots here and there because of all the breakouts I've been dealing with. But overall, I think that this looks really nice. I'll figure out better ways to wear this as I go. Because this is the first time I'm legit wearing this wig. Is there anything else that I'm forgetting? One thing I think I'm going to do is, just so that I feel like I can control the hair a little bit to throw. Let me see if I can put this. I'm definitely not going to be wearing it. But will this help my hair stay put? Let me see. It does not really keep my hair in place, but it's not a bad look overall. I think it's very cute. I might take it off in the car, you don't know. But I hope that my mom is ready, so let's go. Remember, remember mom there were low-key hair training. Don't know how to give it to your hair. We're wearing the same type of hair. <laughs> Let's go. Yes, it's light. I like the 
blend very well. There's a little bit of sweetness that this stew brings. It's very nice. Mm. <laughs> Boys and girls, hello. I'm back here. I'm actually heading out because I just finished a meeting. But I'm going out to have like a late lunch with my friend CD. My perfume. By the way, I'm wearing this dress from Zara. Like linking anything for you guys from Zara or ASOS is like third world war because it doesn't matter if it's like one week after you got it. The probability that you're going to see sold out is high. I'm going to be mixing these two guys. Look at the Dream Dusk that I bought recently. Can you guys see what's going on here? Okay, this is how much I love this perfume. I'm on to my third bottle. Somebody actually sent me a DM yesterday saying, Demma, do you know that Dream Dusk is on sale at the moment? And I'm like, what? What do you say? She said it's on sale. So I'm going to go and get a third bottle for sure. I remember there was a time I made a mistake and I told you guys that this perfume is Bulgari. It is actually not Bulgari. This perfume is from who again? Paco Robana, Rabone. On anything with this perfume. Hmm? How can you people not have the name of the brand? Listen, yeah. I'm going to have this linked in the, the description box. But I, this is also a very good floral, okay? Um, I'm going to put lip balm on. I'm going to do a quick unboxing before I leave here, by the way. But lip balm on. So I hope I'm, that my lace is not that obvious, please. I've been really enjoying this curly wig. It's from Chrissy. Like I told you guys, and I'm also going to have it linked in the in the what description box. I don't know why I sound so distracted, but guys, like, I actually want to chat with you guys. Do I have time? Yes, I think I have a few minutes, okay? First of all, I have a few things to show you guys here. What am I holding here? Hangers. I'm coming. Let me open this up because I have a PR package that was delivered from Pixie today. I'll open that too. But guys, what do I have here? Hangers. Hangers from AliExpress. Okay, I came back. Obviously, I bought some clothes when I traveled. If you've not seen my last vlog, by the way, you are balling yourself. Go and watch my last vlog. Go and watch my last vlog, it was my birthday vlog. I came back, obviously, if you travel, you buy new clothes. I bought new clothes, I was looking for more hangers to put it. Tell me the reason why I went to Ebano, guys. I went to Ebano to buy new hangers, okay? And they were selling five pieces of hanger for nine, I say five pieces. Because at first I went, I wasn't sure. I asked somebody to please on their way help me check again. When we, I thought, count it, she counted it. Five pieces of hanger for like 9,000 naira. No. I'm not doing that. What did I do? I went to AliExpress. I went to AliExpress immediately and hangers were so cheap there. Like you will find like 10 for, yeah. What I'm trying to explain to you that it was like cheaper. Okay, I'm going to show you guys the hangers that I got. Like what I would have easily paid for those five pieces of hanger got me about 10 to 15 hangers on AliExpress. Okay, so I have my scissors here. Let's just cut this really quickly. Jesus, no. I hope I've not broken the hanger. Okay, I don't think so. So these are white hangers. I can't remember how much these were. I might put it on the screen or they will be linked in the description box, okay? Oh, the light just came back up. Yeah, I got these. So these are 10. Just so people understand what I'm saying, these are 10 pieces. They are wire hangers, but they are also strong hangers. There's no reason for me to pay 5,000 naira for five pieces of hangers. I also got some gold hangers as well because... I had these gold hangers that I bought from AliExpress years ago and I had all of them in one wardrobe so I was like okay let me get more hangers to put in that wardrobe. See I also got gold hangers, I got about 10 so I got like 10, 10 of each style and everything came to me like I've explained to you guys in two weeks and they were delivered to my house. Hold on let me open this one again. Oh wow, nicely bubble wrapped though, no time for stories. I just decided to be a bit more patient. The clothes I wanted to hang, I just packed all of them inside a waterproof bag and I was waiting for my hangers to arrive. So now that my hangers are here, I'm going to hang them. Oh, hold on. I'm actually happy that I'm talking to you guys from the office because I had promised you guys to talk, that I'll talk more on the office. Okay, so this one, I got just five off and these are clip hangers. Hmm. Okay, why is this plastic? Just look at this nonsense. Yeah, okay, with this one I'm proper pissed actually. To be honest, if you still want this, it's just an FYI, but guys, you have plastic, I'm gonna spray paint, okay? This is plastic, 
pre-painted plastic i don't really think it's bad it's just that i was expecting metal hangers not plastic that was pre-painted gold i like i'm the queen of spray painting but why would you do this to me nah yeah the quality i also don't know how long this is going to last for me but i'm just telling you guys fyi i'm going to have all these hangers linked in the description box then the last thing that just came this is from pixie this was delivered this afternoon skin treat so this is probably skin care so it looks like this it says pixie skin treats and this is their brightening face serum Ooh, okay let's see. it's a vitamin c serum actually brightening energizing nourishing biodegradable capsules perfect dose every time so we're just going to take this out Ooh, nice okay so these are those things i'm not gonna waste a capsule doesn't actually have any obvious scent to it but i'm not planning to waste any capsule okay it looks like this so it's all these capsules that you kind of open and then i think you apply on your face i need sunglasses let me see if i have one by the way this is the handbag that i'm carrying out this is my tory birch it's the same one that i traveled with this bag i've been really really enjoying it i'm not gonna lie to you guys i'm also going to have it linked if you're looking for a very good work tote or you're looking for a nice um travel tote or like just everyday bag work bag through things and even if it's not just for work i think that this is a very good idea okay why do i feel like i need sunglasses hold on i just grabbed it okay so now that i've done that very quickly guys i've been in a very funky place when it comes to work okay i redesigned my website i think it looks really good at the moment i'm going to have it linked in the description box but however since i redesigned that website like i've gotten into this phase where i feel like i have to redesign everything now because the vibe of the website is just so completely different from what i have going on on youtube and i like it when things match you know so i think i want to do something about that the last time i did something like this was in 2018 the one before that was in 2016 so i think it's actually about time because 2018 is a long time ago right so i just feel like i need to change a few things up so i have a few people doing stuff for me now like designing stuff for me that i'm going to approve some of them when i come back this evening but um i think i even made a list of things i need to bring up really quickly hold on listen guys like random times of the day i just remember random things i want to tell you guys and i just write them down so what did i say because i know i made a list of stuff that i wanted to bring up oh yeah i just read it okay i've shown you guys the aliexpress hangers um, I was supposed to have a video up last week, but it didn't go up on time because the video wasn't approved on time There was a lot that just kind of led to that. So that video is not going to go up this Friday just before this Sunday um, I'm going to pick up my amended clothes tomorrow being Friday. They should be ready by then By the way, I woke up today to a new social media Elon Musk needs I don't see let me say something yeah like i love twitter so much but i don't understand what's going on and then i feel like the kind of chaos we've seen recently because just a couple of days ago there was a whole thing about limiting tweets when there is chaos in your house it just leaves some it leaves room for somebody to come in and do something and that's what's kind of happened i also guys like yeah last thing i wanted to talk to you guys about was i, I want to plan more activities with my friends i want to go out because i've not seen a few people in quite some time so i'm thinking of like doing a little mermaid watch party ish i know that film one or film house has these rooms where you can rent so you and your friends can watch movies in and then like if you pay it comes with food and all of that i think i might want to do that i've not seen the little mermaid yet i think that i've heard that it's very very good so just maybe ask some of my friends if they want to watch and like guys i really don't like the thing about going out for me is that like it's always kind of longish for me but then again i want to actually do more stuff for people like i really like and love like of just create the activities because i know that a lot of them are always game for things that i'm comfortable with so i think i'm going to try so this let's all start with this little mermaid watch party and see if it is something that can work okay um is there anything else i want to tell you people i really don't think so let's go i'll stop at the supermarket to get bean bags because i wrote that down but i hope you guys are doing well it's been a weird week for me i'm not going to lie i've not been very consistent with vlogging because i've had family in and out of my house since my auntie died i'm here now so a lot of them have taken this opportunity to come and visit my uncle's family it's not been easy guys i'm not going to lie but um we're really trying 
so that's kind of what has led and you know when you have family around there's so many things to do at a point i technically didn't even have my car because family members were using my car to do things and run errands and go and visit people in uh, or visit who they needed to visit in lagos you know that kind of thing but let me go now i'm going to maple i'm meeting sadie and when i come back i have some work to do i'll see you guys tomorrow most likely but i'll also see you guys when i get to maple okay okay She's so pretty. Look at her. I'm like, you should see your face. Don't worry, I'll do my vlog. You'll see your face. <laughs> I'm making her drink bubble tea. She's not had yeah. bubble tea before. So she saw me ordering, she was like, oh, she doesn't mind. So this is Passion Food Bubble Tea with Mango Boba. Not had this in a while, so. <laughs> It's just, <laughs> See, you're living a fake life. I she could, I don't think you live that fake life. She couldn't. She couldn't even. Try it. Let's see. Try it. Let's see. If you like iced tea, you most likely like it. Like so let's see. Why is it strong? What? It's like because you have to chew it. Just hey. you can also avoid it. If you don't. Guys, I am with Mama. I know you guys are blessed. Listen, they have not seen you in God knows how long. We are we're going to have lunch. I'm basically not eating anything all day. We're going to toast. Okay, I'll show you guys shortly, but I haven't seen Mads in ages. <laughs> so we are going to toast. This is just right there. Okay. I'm with Mas. I'm so hungry. So I got the raspberry iced tea. This is the this is like my go-to whenever I come here. Mass has a croissant and water. <laughs> so hope that this is as good as I remember it to be. <laughs> So scrambled eggs, meneh and we got, is this the ice cream? Yes please. Okay, so we got waffles and ice cream too. There's a lot of, what are the bread? Okay, I'm bringing the bread. So yes, we're waiting for bread. So this is mine, this is mine. This will probably all just share. This particular one comes with feta cheese. I told them to put it on the side. But there's a salad here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Perfect. that's good. Because yeah. Mars really wanted a salad. <laughs> They're bringing our bread. Um, this is it, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I really like it here. Like, really, really like it here. The food is always good, so let us eat. Don't keep what too long again. See Pocahontas. Real life Pocahontas. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye, baby. Bye. Love you. Love you too. Okay, guys, this is legit my second take at this because I'm trying to film again, but like it's so hot because I mounted my phone initially on the dashboard and it made my phone so hot that now my phone is too hot so I can't mount it again. So, guys, I just left church. Sometimes I start my weeks by going to church, like some um, what is it called? Midday mass. Okay, I do that, but then I want to try and get run a few errands just to round up this vlog. I want to get matcha. I already tried the supermarket before I went to church, but I was rushing so I couldn't vlog that they did not have it. I'm going to check Hartley's now. Hopefully, they have it here. If they don't, I might just crap the whole idea or even just ask my shopper to help me because as it is now, there are things that are piling up that my shopper might help me with. My retinol, I'm also out of my La Roche retinol. Some of you might be like, Dima, why didn't you just buy this when you were in the UK? Guys, I tried. Okay, I really tried okay so i normally buy my laroche products from boots and i went to about three four boots while i was in the uk and every time we get to the laroche shelf you see a space for the retinol but the retinol isn't there so it was either it was always sold out or i was going on bad days i also don't know if they are phasing it out laroche however here in nigeria they have a retinol serum and i want to try that out and just see how that goes then 
and then i also want to possibly stop at the seafood market because i want to get calamari prawn and shrimp <laughs> it's sounding like a big man's list to be honest if i go there and the price they're saying is not making sense i'll just abandon it because even some of the seafood dishes that sometimes i order for takeouts the price is dancing okay so i actually if the price for these things don't make that much sense we're gonna start eating chicken okay yes yeah, so i want to just check for this matcha i'm hoping that this thing i'm saying is actually recording because like i said this is my second take i also don't want to drive around too much because fuel is you people know what fuel is doing i also want to buy my perfume my favorite perfume someone told me that it's on sale so i want to go to the mall to grab an extra bottle of it hopefully it's still on sale and then because the perfume store is very very close to med plus pharmacy so i'm just hoping that i walk from one to the other without issues okay okay <laughs> trying to look very well but I don't think that they have I don't think that they have matcha the chai latte is a vegan chai latte I don't even know what this means so is this dairy free that's what I'm trying to see hmm. there's no matcha they do not have matcha it's unfortunate but um hmm. yeah okay oh much green no this one has turmeric i don't want anything that has turmeric in it why does it have turmeric uh, you won't do four thousand Four thousand. I want shrimp too. You will peel the shrimp, Abby. Yes. Okay. One kilo shrimp. Let me see. Let me see. Two kilo is too much. Okay. Do one kilo. One one kilo. Let me even see that shrimp. Can I? I don't know if I need more shrimp. This is one kilo. Let me see. Let me see what is inside. This is just that one kilo you measured now. Ah, it's too small. I need more shrimp. Yes, yes. but how come this is one kilo? Why is it now reduced like this? After? Not that many. Oh yeah, you can do another kilo. Okay. Guys, um a quick recap because i think i'm going to round the vlog up here just a very quick recap oh my gosh every time i sit down here i need to put sunglasses on because of how bright it is i didn't find my matcha didn't see matcha tea at hartley's not sure where else to check but i i think that i don't know i might also ask someone to just help me buy it abroad like because to be honest it tends to be cheaper for me like my shopper that i use like shopper helper like you can just tell her whatever you want she will help you buy and you can pay her back in naira i'm going to leave her details in the description box as well so you can pay her back in naira but then again if it's a very small item then there's a flat shipping fee of maybe about 10 to 20 pounds for her to ship it down to you which is roughly around what dhl and the likes will also set but you will get your item within one week so i might actually use that for matcha let's see i stopped at the seafood market you guys saw i got about two kilos of calamari and two kilos of shrimp i'm going to go home now and wash that and store it in the freezer because i want to make seafood pasta this week i was also hoping to see if i could get whole wheat linguine but hartley's didn't have i normally buy from them but they didn't have um what was the last thing so i went to get my perfume but they said that the sale was online so the sale is not happening in store but the sale is happening online that's what the perfume store said so i should check their website however i was uh, i got i stopped at med plus and i got two things so i got the retinol i just don't know where this is i i swear guys i have bought this before i have bought it before what happened to it i just don't know and i have this feeling that it is somewhere inside my house oh my god sorry this thing is slanting i have this feeling that it is somewhere inside my house hiding hopefully i find it but uh just so you guys can see oh gosh oh i was so scared i thought i had just popped it open 
but this is what it looks like please stay put guys i'm so sorry that this thing is bending but i only use retinol night time okay and then i also got this pimple patch that someone recommended that i get for my breakouts so this one is from a brand called uncover they had it at med plus it was the only pimple patch they had to be honest so i got it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to me if you're not yet subscribed i'll see you guys in my next one